In the solitude of the sea, deep from human vanity, and the pride of life that planned her, stilly couches she. Still chambers, late the pyres of her salamandrine fires, cold currents thrid and turn to rhythmic tidal lyres. Over the mirrors meant to glass the opulent, the sea worm crawls, grotesque, slimed, dumb, indifferent. Jewels in joy designed to ravish the sensuous mind lie lightless, all their sparkles bleared and black and blind. Dim moon-eyed fishes near gaze at the gilded gear and query, what does this vain gloriousness down here? Well, while was fashioning this creature of cleaving wing, the imminent will that stirs and urges everything, prepared a sinister mate for her, so gaily great, a shape of ice for the time far and dissociate, and as the smart ship grew in stature, grace and hue, in shadowy, silent distance, grew the iceberg too. Alien they seemed to be, no mortal eye could see the intimate welding of their later history, or sign that they were bent by paths coincident on being and on twin halves of one August event, till the spinner of the years said now, and each one hears, and consummation comes, and jars two hemispheres.